thank you, Abigail. You make me sound a lot cooler than, you know, I really am. I mean, I'm no one special, in my opinion. Uh, just an average kid that has average, uh, that has above average uh, goals and ambitions in life. Guys, uh, I just want to quickly introduce myself. You guys don't know me. My name is Julian Throne. I'm a Platinum 2000 right now in the company. I'm sneezing away from Platinum 5K and smashing the chairman. So kind of crazy. Um, I started an IML about two, two years ago, actually, around this time. It was April 2016. Um, and then, you know, I left to go launch another Forex company summer of 2016. Worst decision I could have ever made for myself. But, you know, obviously we're back at home where we all belong here in IML. And, uh, you know, it's been a crazy two years, guys. You know, Abby wanted me to talk about commitment. She wanted me to talk about consistency. Uh, and those two go hand in hand with a lot of things. Uh, because I remember even back in the day whenever I started, you know, guys, you have to understand, like, it, it's, it's not going to be easy. It's just not. Building this business, if you, guys are, if you guys are looking to build this business and looking to build it long term so that you can hit six and seven figures here on the business side with residuals, Guys, it's not the easiest thing in the world. And if someone told you it was, my apologies because they were lying. It's simple because of what we have here and because of the system that we have here in IML. But you will face a lot of trials and tribulations in your journey. And understand that you're all going to have your own specific type of journey. You guys may go through similar things that a lot of us have, may have gone through as well. But you're going to have your own unique journey as well. You have to understand that you never want to compare yourself to someone's chapter 20 when it's your chapter one. You know, always, always be celebrating, you know, all the people who are, who are doing well in the company, whether they're trading, whether they're building the business, be happy for them, be genuinely happy for them, but just go back to literally doing what you have to do for yourself as an individual and as a leader. Okay, so when it comes to commitment, when it comes to consistency, guys, there's a lot of things that can come into place that try to take you off course from your commitment and your consistency. There's a lot of things that will come into, you got to, to you have to understand, like even for me, in the beginning, I had a lot of distractions. I had a girlfriend at the time that I had to get rid of, unfortunately. And it wasn't because we didn't, we didn't you know, have feelings for each other or anything like that. It was because I was growing as an individual and she wasn't. So I had to let that go. And ever since I've been single and I've been focusing on myself, I believe 100% that you attract what you are and not what you want. In all areas of life, whether it's business, whether it's relationships, whatever it is, you attract what you are, you do not attract what you want, okay? Another thing that comes into cons with consistency and everything like that, okay? You have to make sure that you are scheduling out your days accordingly to what fits your specific schedule, okay? Some of you may have kids. Some of you may have full-time school. Maybe some of you have full-time, part-time jobs, Okay? In order to stay consistent with doing this business, you have to make sure you are organized and making sure that you are scheduling out everything accordingly so that you are not feeling like you're cluttered in your, in your, in your everyday life. Okay? You, you need to understand that organization is very key when being an entrepreneur, when building a business. Okay? That was the biggest thing that also helped me with my consistency was making sure that I got my stuff together. Whenever I have meetings, whenever I have trainings, just like this one I had with Abby. As soon as she let me know last night, I jot that down in my calendar. Boom. I have that set in my schedule. So now I have that going on at that time. Okay. You guys have to understand there's a lot, there are a lot of things that are going to come into your way. Some of you guys are going to hit the rank that you always wanted to hit. And then you're going to de-rank. Are you going to let that come in the way of your consistency? Okay. Are you going to let that? You guys, you guys feel good whenever, if, if you guys were in Vegas, you guys are feeling great. You guys are feeling good. The vibes are awesome. You guys are surrounded by over 6,000 plus individuals from all over the world in one setting for IML. And you feel super motivated. You feel so motivated that you want to go out there and you want to tell the entire world. And then life starts hitting you. Okay. Then life starts hitting. And then your environment starts trying to, you know, keep you captive in many ways. Guys, environment is such, I, I, I've realized now that a lot of you will not make a lot, a lot of everyone here in IML, you will not make it long term if you are not switching up your environment. Okay? The, 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 the basics behind that is this, guys. Your environment has a lot to do with the way that you think, the way that you feel on a daily basis. 
okay, understand that, you know, you can, you can learn so many different skill sets with techniques and trying to prospect and trying to promote, trying to build this business. I want you guys to understand this. Everything begins in the mind, no matter what. Okay. Once you master your mind, it doesn't matter what you touch. It doesn't matter what business. It doesn't matter if it's trading. It doesn't matter what it is. You will be successful at it because you have mastered your mind. That's the biggest thing that you want to that you want to do when staying consistent as well. Stay consistent with developing yourself as an individual and as a leader every single day. If, if you do, if, guys understand this, this business is built through leadership and influence, nothing else. It doesn't matter what it is. Your leadership and influence level is what matters most in this business. So the more and more that you continuously add value to yourself, the more and more the world is going to come back and reward you with value. It's going to continue growing all your businesses, everything that you touch. You'll be surprised. Guys, consistency is such a big thing here because you're going to go through hard times. 29 miles. You're going to go through hard times. Some of you guys are going to be dead broke at one point, and you're going to want to quit. Some of you guys, you're going to get fired from your job, and you're going to want to quit. You're going to have that stand in the way of your consistency. Some of you guys are going to you know, break up with significant other. Some of you guys are going to get kicked out of your house. Some of you guys are going to get in an argument with your parents. Some of you guys are going to get an argument with your siblings. Whatever it is, okay, you cannot let that, you cannot let those circumstances stand in the way of your consistency. You cannot let your circumstances distract you, okay? You need to be consciously aware of what's going on, but subconsciously, you're not paying attention to it whatsoever. You're focused on what's the goal. What is the goal here? What am I going to do to continuously build this business? Man, sorry about that. What am I going to continuously do to develop myself as a leader, as an individual here in this space, okay? We're, we're exiting right here. Okay, so you guys have to understand this. Commitment is doing the things you say you're going to do long after the mood you set them in is over. I'm going to say that one more time. Commitment is doing the things you say you're going to do long after. Sorry about that. Oh, shit. You, the mood you set them in. Okay, that's a big thing, and that's what that's what made me that's what made me uh, really open my eyes. My apologies, guys. I'm over here freaking driving all over the highway, uh, but that's what opened my eyes as well. When I heard that, when I heard someone say that, I was like, you know what? That makes a lot of sense because I feel really good whenever I come out of an event. I feel really good whenever I'm around my people, but whenever I'm by myself, those those negative thoughts end up coming in. And they, they 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 try to you know, they try to seep in and they try to basically discourage me on how to stay committed and stay con consistent with all of this. Guys, understand that. We're going in. Going in. Okay. Guys, understand that for the first year of this, uh, of me building this business, I built my way up to Platinum 1000 with no service on my phone. Okay. That's, that's, that has, I look back at it and the only way that I've been able to build my business from literally social media from Facebook and Instagram, I've gotten like a lot of my leaders from Facebook and Instagram. Okay. And I look back at it and the only thing that I can come up with is the fact that I was developing myself as an individual. So that's the way I was, I was able to go ahead and attract the right people into my life and into my business so that I can continuously grow. Okay. If, like I said, all, all the time, guys, it, this is not rocket science. I promise that if you take the time to develop yourself, especially if this is your first company, especially if this is your first one or two years here in the industry, okay, understand that this is going to be the hardest two years, okay? The first one to two years are the hardest. This is just straight up truth, okay? And you're going to have a lot of things come up. I was broke. I didn't let that stand in my consistency. I had my grandmother who always nagged me about certain things about the business, okay? I didn't let that stand in the way of my commitment or my consistency, okay? I had a lot of people who doubted me, a lot of people who talked crap, a lot of people who, who weren't on the same vision, on the same, 
uh, mind of thinking that I was at. But I did not let that stand in the way of my commitment and my consistency. You guys have made a decision. You guys are already here in IML. You guys made the decision to learn a skill set. A skill set that will pay dividends to you long term in the future. You guys cannot just let that slip away. Things are going to happen. And that's just life. They're going to happen even, even more whenever you have a lot of money too. So don't think it ever goes away. Life is always going to continue happy. Guys, I was so broke I couldn't even afford to get involved into IML. I sold half my closet of clothes, my flat screen Samsung, my Apple TV. I didn't let that stand in the way of my commitment and my consistency. I made the decision once. That's it. Boom. I'm going to stay committed. I'm going to stay consistent. I don't care how long it takes for me to hit chairman. I don't care how long it takes for me to get my people to where they want to be. Whatever it is, it's going to happen. And the right people will stay in the business. Hey, but you guys have made a decision. You guys have made a decision to do this, and it's a long-term decision. Don't come in here thinking that you're going to make hundreds and thousands of dollars off of trading whether it's crypto or foreign exchange, okay? Don't come in here with that mentality. You're coming in here to learn a skill set, all right? And guess what? If this is your second go around, that's, guess what? That's even better because you, you're, you, this is going to be your last run. This is going to be your last run here at IML. Guys, we just partnered with the number one crypto trader in, like, the entire world. Like, that's a lot of leverage for a company, a lot of leverage. And... The future is definitely bright here. I want you guys to understand that when Miami comes in September, what, where do you want to be? You have to continuously ask yourself. And once you do, once you find out where it is you want to be by Miami, boom, write it down, stay committed, and stay consistent. Okay? You have, an amaz you have amazing leadership. I, I rarely see ladies like Abigail and Alejandra step up to the plate. And literally go ahead and just boom. They're always all over the world. They're traveling. They're always, their environment is always changing. That's the reason why they're always uplifted. You guys have to get away sometimes from the same environment. It's the same thing that I had to do myself. This past week, I just went to California uh, for some business moves. And then I just, I just got back from everything. And while I was out there, I had time to literally think for myself. I had time to literally clear the space, get away from my from my place in Dallas and just be me. Just just think for what it is that I want to do, how it is that I want that I see myself in the next four, 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 five, ten years. Okay. And that's the biggest thing that you need to understand as well. Okay. This is a five, ten year plan, guys. Nothing just comes like this, whether it's trading or whether it's building the business. Okay. You guys have to practice patience. Don't be lazy on your day-to-day bit -day, on your day on your day-to-day -day work. But be patient. With the, you have to trust the process. You guys hear this over and over and over again. That's what's going to help you stay committed. That's what's going to help you stay consistent in this business. When all of everything is going down, when everything seems to not be going your way, guys, it's going to feel like complete chaos before your biggest blessing. It's going to feel like complete chaos before your biggest blessing. You just need to hold on and you need to trust the process. You need to understand that everyone has gone through something similar to your story and they have made it out. I promise you guys can tell me, you guys can tell me each of your stories right now and I'll find someone in IML or even outside of IML who had a similar story and got out of it, was, was able to become successful through that same similar story. So if they can do it, there is no reason why you can't do it either. You have to continuously surround yourself with like-minded individuals. Go out if you guys if you guys are in the same um in the same uh same market the same uh city the same town whatever it is go out have fun together go out like guys don't don't even go out there to like build a business go out there and build relationships with people go out there and build friendships go out and figure out how it is that you can help them potentially with this but at the end of the day you're building relationships go out there and just be cool with people and I promise. The more and more people vibe with you, the more and more they're going to want to do whatever it is that you're doing. Okay? 
I also have uh, one of my leaders out here in, uh, from, from, OKC, from OKC, Mr. Derek McGee. He's over here shotgun. And I'll have him, I'll have him talk a little bit. He's a Platinum 2000 as well. So I'll have him talk about a little bit of our commitment as well because me and him have been going hard for over a year now. And uh, we haven't seen the easiest things together. It hasn't been the easiest journey. So, Derek, if you want to go ahead and spit some knowledge too, bro. Dang, guest, guest speaker again, number two. Well, real quick, guys, um, everything he's saying, um, definitely take it to heart. Um, you know, attract you attract what, what you are. Um, that's, that holds true. I was in a, I was in a company where, um, you know, I reached out to Julian on social media. And literally had no idea who he was. Um, he posted some profits that he made money from his phone. And I wanted to uh, see how I can invest and diversify my portfolio. Well, come to know, I was in a company, a direct sales company with a product-based um, service. And so basically, I had a 1,000 plus people in my organization. But I, I literally um, saw what this was and saw the, the difference in how how this is compared to a product-based company and I made the move um, with several people from my organization guys and so everything he's saying about you attract um, what you are you know how you attract the people into your life how you manifest things that seriously happened I honestly thought I was going to uh, recruit him into my business um, that was my whole thought process but uh, it, it kind of worked out the other way around so um, guys I'm not gonna take up too much of your time the only thing that I could tell you guys um, after being in several companies um, and building business on the business side is that you get out of it what you put into it. Um, I tell people, I tell my team all the time, I say, you want to treat this like a hobby, you'll get paid like a hobby. If you want to treat it like a business, you'll get paid like a business. And so um, it just comes down to treating it like a business, guys. It, treating it like a $5.3 trillion a day business. Uh, that's all it comes down to. I work with 17-year-olds all the way up to literally 72-year-olds with this. And, and I tell people the only difference between the people that succeed and the people that don't are the people that don't treat it like a hobby and the people that treat it like a business and also the people that um, stay committed uh, and stay the course even when things don't go their way immediately. So I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you guys. Um, you have great leaders like Julian said along with him speaking. So at this time, I believe now I'm going to hand it back over to Abigail to uh, close it out. Thank you, guys. Definitely, definitely appreciate it. Julian, you good? Yes, ma'am. All right, perfect. I appreciate you guys hopping on. I'm going to go ahead and close the call. Thank you guys so much. Um, guys, really quick, for those of you that are left on this call, I want to recap from last night. Uh, I hope everybody was on that seven-figure call. That was absolutely ridiculous. If you missed it, I posted um, both the recordings. There was like two different videos in the, uh, in the updates chat in Telegram. But – I have all the actually recap right here because I know a lot of people message me with questions. So let me just break this down for you. And if you guys have any individual questions, just message me or, you know, we can talk on the end of this call. Um, so here's the breakdown. Crypto Academy is now live. Basics one through four, I believe that's what it is, is up and running. You guys have the ability to go out there in IML Academy and go ahead and check it out. Um, I know that there's multiple, multiple different languages that is being updated as we speak. I know Jason was talking about it on the call last night and many more to come. Uh, Forex and crypto, the Forex, okay, so the Web Analyzer is now having both Forex and crypto, but instead of making it separate, it's combined and it's only $15 a month with, for both of them. Only $15 for both Forex and the crypto Web Analyzer. Guys, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. It should be way more than $15. So take advantage of that. Um, swipe trades is still $15. I know that there was updates that they're going to try to do. I think it was something like, you know, you're going to be able to search for your pay, for your favorite pair for your master trader, whatever it may be. Um, swipe trades plus is now going to be a thing as well. And all I know with that is it's going to be uh, $15 as well a month. And it's basically double the signals. As I hear more information, you guys will hear more information as well. Keep you guys updated. Um, swipe coin right now it is live it's up and running if you don't have it literally go download it in the app store right now they already sent out their first um their first alert today their first trade idea today um but i know it's going to be free for the next six weeks so you know april 29th last night through the next six weeks after that it's going to be 99 dollars a month um so i'm going to break this down really quick guys because i know a lot of people were asking me this question earlier uh, you do not have to have swipe trades to access swipe coin. Okay. You can just get swipe coin on its own. And then also you don't have to have swipe trades to access swipe trades. Plus you can just get swipe trades plus. So hopefully that clears up everything. 
Um, and then also everything, guys, everything is free when you get your two and free. So everything I just went over, everything that's already in the academy, everything is free when you get your two and free. And just another thing too, because I know a lot of people on this call are building. Once you have your, you know, once you've hit P600, that will not only cover the cost for everything, but you'll also have, have more and then some. Um, but yeah, that's everything it on this call. Unless you guys have any other questions or any details that you wanted to go over with me, definitely message me or just unmute yourself right now. Okay, I'm just going to end it. Guys, I appreciate you. Um, call is, another call is tomorrow. I'm going to post the details in the chat. I appreciate all of you guys hopping on. Julian, Derek, thanks so much for, for, for coming in and kind of uh, sharing a little details. I'm going to go ahead and end this. It was recorded, so I'm going to post it in the chat. Other than that, guys, I will talk to you later.